of the State of Palestine to the Federal Republic of Nigeria says 15 UN agency leaders in a joint statement have asked Israel to cease its assault on Gaza and on the humanitarians trying to help. Ambassador of the Embassy of the State of Palestine, Abdullah Shawesh, disclosed this while addressing journalists in Abuja during the weekly briefing on non-stop bleeding at the hands of the USA-Israeli genocide in Palestine. According to Shawash, 90% of Gaza's population have been displaced and are living in temporary shelters without money to purchase basic necessities. Shawash further notes that 11,923 students have been killed while 19,199 were injured in the past 13 months. He added that 341 school and university buildings are targeted in military attacks, with 77 of them completely destroyed. Development. We, the Palestinians, were left behind. 398 days of non-stop bleeding at the hands of the United States of America, Israel, different slaughtering machine. Here are some statistical figures. 43,391 Palestinians were murdered and, and 102,337 were injured in Gaza, with the vast majority of them women and the children. And they occupied West Bank, including East Jerusalem, 777 Palestinians were murdered during the last 13 months. 923 students were killed and 19,199 injured in the past 13 months. Additionally, 341 school and university buildings were targeted in military attack, with 77 of them completely destroyed. Shawesh further states that only four of Gaza, that the six hospitals, had not been damaged, destroyed, or raided, adding that 880 healthcare workers have been killed. Israel dropped 85,000 tons of bombs on Gaza, exceeding those dropped in the World War II, including internationally banned white phosphor bombs. In just one year, the United States of America has spent at least 22 billion, 76 billion of military aid to Israel and the related United States operation in the region, seating the Watson Institution for International and Public Affairs. An estimate 90% of Gaza population have been displaced and are living in temporary shelters without cash to purchase basic necessity, necessities like food, clean 